What's on your school supply checklist? Sure, your kids need new clothes, crayons, and notebooks, but there are a few other items you don't want to forget. Parents' back-to-school list should include scheduling an appointment with either their pediatrician or primary care physician, just to have a general checkup to make sure there are no underlying health issues. Also, if your child plays sports, this is a great time to get that sports physical taken care of so they can participate in the school-sponsored sports. Another thing you should do is check and make sure your child's immunizations are up to date. You can do that with your pediatrician, primary care physician, or even at your local health unit. It's also important for parents to emphasize the importance of hand washing. New teachers and new classmates mean exposure to new germs. Well, hand washing is the single most effective thing that we can do to prevent the spread of germs and illnesses in our homes, in our schools, and in our hospitals. It can prevent the spread of cold germs, flu, staph. Also, it can keep pink eye and chicken pox out of your house. Staying healthy isn't always about avoiding germs or getting shots. Sometimes it's about making good choices. School-age children need at least 10 to 12 hours of sleep a night. Also, feed them a healthy breakfast. Our bodies need fuel to learn. They need energy. Make sure they have whole grain cereals. Uh, eggs are a great source of protein, fruits. In addition, listen to your children. When they come home from school, they're excited. They're talking about their teachers and their homework and their friends. Listen to them carefully. You may be able to avoid some problems before they ever start. For more information about childhood health, visit rapidsregional.com or call 877-801-8441 to find a pediatrician near you.